Well, it certainly has been a very wet start to our May in many spots, especially as you headed farther south into the uh, mid-Atlantic states, kind of creeping a little farther north in that. And our wet May will continue now with more rain and thunder. It could even see some spotty severe weather concerns, but then temperatures will be cooler as you head farther north. Uh, yesterday, though, we made it into the 80s, again, even close to 90 down a little bit farther south into D.C., but 60s hanging on in Burlington and into Caribou. But overall, it was a, a milder day. Temperatures on Sunday anywhere from 5 to 10 or 15 degrees above average. Also picked up just a little bit of rain. New York City, Pittsburgh, Buffalo, though, about a third of an inch of rain. And again, we're not quite done. So this is how much rain we've had so far this May. Head down near D.C. You can see some six-plus inch uh, tallies there. Of course, you probably watched the Preakness, and it was very wet out in Baltimore. Uh, congratulations to Justify once again on his way to a triple crown and uh, four inches in Philadelphia so far this month. So we've had a big surplus in some of those areas down into the mid-Atlantic states. Now, there is a general thunderstorm threat. The risk of severe weather, though, back west into the Ohio Valley. It does creep a little farther north into Tuesday. As you can see, Cincinnati over to Pittsburgh under a marginal threat, and then the marginal threat shifts a little bit farther south from Norfolk into Raleigh. So that's what we're watching again into the um, next couple of days. Widely scattered showers and storms will be developing, as you can see there, and kind of shifting into the region. Some more rain into midweek, but maybe not quite as heavy. Have a good one.